Hi guys, Snake Dotter here. Welcome back to The Walking Dead. Right, well, in the last part, I think if you remember, we had uh, a bit of a run in with a lot of uh, bow and arrow armed bandits um, while we were patrolling the electric fence. And uh, yeah, one of our colleagues got shot with an arrow. And we were chased uh, uh, along the ground by a half, uh, a half disembodied zombie. So uh, yeah, we escaped them, got back to the farmhouse. And uh, yeah, now we've got to just go and uh, try and find these bandits and see what we can do because we need to uh, make sure this area is safe before we go much further. That thing keeps a fence electrified. Okay, well, we don't want to touch that then, do we? Nothing here. Come then, let's, uh, let's look at the fence, do we? I'm sure that's fairly safe. We've got to go and uh, deal with the bandits, actually. These, uh, let me talk to them. Let's go through here. Let's look at a hay pile. Fascinating. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Okay. Let's go and chat to these lot. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? They'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? He's very, uh, caring, isn't he? Ooh, look at his eyes over there, on the left. <laughs> They're rather scary. Um, how do we feel about leaving the motor in? How do you feel about leaving Let's the ask that. It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. Quite so keen. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I uh, take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Lee, I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? And there, You're good she's, a, she's a good leader. Let's, let's keep her. Intentions are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Okay, can we talk to Dad? No, nope, good. Okay, let's uh, let's get out of here then. We could go and uh, get these bandits. It's the cornfield. Anything interesting over there? Let's away from the fence. On hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Indeed. Okay. Go in the barn. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Indeed. Right. I think we get get back up to the house now. And where's the gate gone? There we are. Let's go back through here and chat to the guys up at the house. We can get out this way, which I'm assuming we can. There we go. Let's go and chat to them. Fellas, how you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there, but we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. Yeah, you probably should have done. Did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? Well said. The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah. Let's go. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll Let's stay do here indeed. and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. You can't come, Clem. She looks a bit unsure. Okay. See anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. 
It's gotta be close. Soup. Here. Oh shit, you found it? I have indeed. Thought I might be able to do a bit of sniping there, but uh, apparently not. Should we go and uh, go and grab some stuff, can we? So we can help ourselves to some some goodies. You see anybody? Nope. Stay on your guard. I'm sure they'll be there somewhere. Watch You're gonna get shot, aren't you? Me. I'm gonna check out the team. Anybody there? Tense moment, a tense moment, very good. Um, nope. Clear. This camp's too small. <coughs> be there it's me. Base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. Okay, let's see what we can get back then. Nothing. Empty. Damn, okay. You've moved their box, which probably wasn't the best thing. Hey, let's look at the lawn chair. Have a sit down. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Anything in the shopping cart? Mm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. There's got to be something here we can take. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <laughs> I'll pass. Oh, it's your dairy box there. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Hello. What do you find? Video camera. Let me see that. It's like a flip. Batteries did. Though. Other oh, video good. camera manufacturers are what available. Else got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, right. You did say she was running things for you. Sounds like you picked a good leader. He's alright. Okay, what we got here? Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Okay. Someone's head in there? Just water. Nope. How boring. Let's have a quick look in the tent. I might as well look over there. Bloody bunny. Oh, man. The hell? Don't you fucking move. Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. 
Jolene. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are. But they swinging ain't that here. gun around. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow. I think she and probably will. Sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're all right, monsters. calm down, love. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? What you talking about? I changed about? my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, You're right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Lovely. Go He's a bit on, mad. tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Well, <laughs> she's dead. God Certainly dead. Damn it. You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. It is true. Thank you for shopping at Save Lots. Great achievement. <laughs> It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. Then it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, so. they'll get the message. Take that crossbow, though. Point it going to waste. Never mind. She probably would have killed you. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. Nope. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. It's getting dark. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody, then. Why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. Let's go see they're getting along. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir crazy when their tummy's empty. That's true. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Maybe we should go and, uh, Go to the barn before we end this video. Let's go and see what they've. Uh, there's old Clem. Let's go and see her, or, or not. Let's not go and see her. Got your hat, girl. I want to find out a bit more about that. I think for now, though, we'll uh, we'll call it a day, and uh, yeah, we'll see what happens in the next part. But for now, guys, I've been Snake Doctor, and we'll see you again soon. Cheers. Bye bye.